This is Harv Peterson with a weekend review. Just like the network news, but who can afford makeup these days? Vaccine supplies for the H1N1 swine flu will be shorter than expected for at least a month. Government officials report that they will fall about 12 million doses short of projections for initial delivery of the vaccine. The folks who want to handle all of our health needs say they are confident they will have enough medicine before H1N1 kills everybody. In a continuing effort to avoid looking like buffoons, the police in the so-called Balloon Boy case in Colorado speculate and the media trying to obscure the fact that they were first on the scene with all the wrong information obediently reports that the hoax required Army helicopters for the search, and therefore federal charges might be filed. Of course, an anxious world awaits the answer to the real question, how will this affect John and Kate? The cabinet of the Maldives, which is about seven feet above sea level, held a meeting underwater, to dramatize predictions that their entire country could be underwater in about a hundred years due to global warming. Taking a cue from the Indian Ocean nation, Republicans have suggested that the U.S. Congress meet in a sea of red ink. And that's the Week in Review, all the news I care to type. I'm Harv Peterson. Later.